Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to increase the rollback time period to install the Windows 11 or even Windows 10 upgrade if you were upgrading from a previous or earlier version of Windows. So Microsoft has adjusted these times over the years from 10 days to 30 days to 60 days. So depending on what version of Windows you're running, depending on what build, it can change and vary. But in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to adjust the time period allotted to 60 days from the upgrade date. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T, best match, check back or registry editor. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. And in order to create a backup, it's very simple. All you have to do is select File and then Export. File name, I recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set Export Range to All. And then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever needed to import it back in, all you have to do is select File and then Import and then navigate to the file location. So pretty straightforward, and let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by double clicking on the HK local machine folder, double click on the system key, so double click on that, and then go and locate setup. If you need to pause the video and take note of our file path, it's up at the top of the screen here. Each backslash is a different sub key or subfolder we've went under to get to this point. And now you want to just right click on this setup folder that we just selected over here on the left side that's highlighted. And you want to select new and then select dwork 32 bit value. Name this value uninstall U-N-I-N-S-T-A-L-L window W-I-N-D-O-W. Again, uninstall window. Do not put an S on the end of Windows. Just make sure it says Window. First letter of each word should be capitalized here. Hit Enter. And once you've done that, go ahead and double click on this value. You want to select underneath Base, you want to select Decimal. And in the Value Data field, you want to delete the zero. Type 60. And this is going to give you 60 days. If you want to do 50 days or 40 days, you can also adjust that here. I don't see why you'd want to limit yourself. So the most you can do is 60. And again, make sure base is decimal before typing in the value here of 60 or whatever number you choose. And select OK. And then once you're done with that, you go ahead and just close out of the registry editor. And you will need to restart your computer for the change to take effect. And there you go, guys. Hopefully at this point you should be good to go. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.